Now, where local sports always come first, this is Action for Sports. Yesterday, the UIL State track meet in Austin started with rain and finished with rain, but today it started with gold and ended with gold. For three of our Rio Grande Valley athletes, Joe Bowling was in Austin all day long. He brings you the latest. Well, after two days of exciting track and field events at the University of Texas in Austin, the UIL State track meet of 2013 comes to an end, and the Rio Grande Valley has three state champions in the mix. In the boys' class five, 300 meter hurdles. It was Donna Sophomore Vince Castillo that took the honors with a gold medal time of 36.71 for Castillo. He was in a final heat that had two others that had better qualifying times, but he grabbed a lead in the final two turns and never let it go. Harlingen's Roman Hernandez finished in fifth place in that race, so the Valley has seen its share of success certainly over the years in that race. Edinburgh Economides Leah Brown competed in her final two of four events in the evening session, finished a respectful fourth place in her 300 meter hurdles, which was the final race of of a tremendous career. Earlier in the day, it was Port Isabel's Danielle Murchison capturing a state title in the girls' shot put at the Class 3 level. And in Class 5 boys, it was La Jolla Palm View's Felipe Vincente winning a gold medal in the shot. On the final day's competition, the Rio Grande Valley had representation in 16 events and no less than 13 individuals who were involved in the events with the best the state of Texas has to offer. A dream come true. I've worked at it since I was a little kid. And now it's not even time for me to relax. I got two more years next. After that, maybe I'll, I'll relax, but until then, I won't. I'm going to keep coming. I felt a lot of aggression from the discus, and I just felt like I really needed to get it out there. I wasn't going to go home without a goal. It's the best feeling in the world, and anything can happen. You're high, you're wave, any, I mean, anything can happen. So again, it's three state champions for the Rio Grande Valley for University of Texas in Austin. I'm Joe Bowling after a very busy two days. Back to you. Thanks a lot, Joe. Those were not the only medals won by Valley kids this week. Weekend, one silver medal for Karina Cox of Los Fresnos in the 5A girls discus. One bronze medal for Hyder Morales of Brownsville Pace in the 5A boys discus. And hey, we had some winners today at the TAPS private school state track meet up in Waco. Of course, yesterday, Brownsville St. Joseph had a winner in the pole vault. Today, it's Brownsville St. Uh, First Baptist with Sebastian Cavazos winning in the boys 200 meter dash a gold and in the boys 100 meter dash a silver. Let's go through them really quickly, show you that Jose Martinez of Wessico East, sixth in the 3200. Daniela Murchison, of course, fourth in the discus after winning the shot put. There's Hiram Morales of Brownsville Pace. Also, Akeem Simeon of Los Fresnos, sixth in the high jump. Leah Brown, four events. She had to do the shot put and the high jump at the same time, eighth in one and fourth in the other. Karina Cox, ninth in the shot put as well. More of the state track meet. Of course, Felipe Valencia, one of the gold winners. Hiram Morales came in fifth in the shot after winning third in the discus. There's Karina Cox's silver. Yesenia Ruiz of Brownsville Pace also in the girls' discus. And Augustus Denham of Sherryland in the boys' pole vault comes in fifth. Tonight, it was the 800-meter run. Daniel Haas of Lyford comes in fourth. Andres Galarza of LaFerry comes in sixth. Kayla Rodriguez of Brownsville Rivera comes in seventh. Jose Martinez of Wesco East places ninth in the 1,600-meter run. And, of course, the hurdles where the Valley does so well. Leah Brown coming in eighth in the 100, fourth in the 300, and the gold medal to Vince Castillo of Donna, fifth place to Roman Hernandez of Harlingen. Congratulations to all of our Valley athletes.